A head injury is a blow to the head from an external force that could be caused by an accident, a fall or an attack. There are different kinds of head injury. A closed head injury is when the brain has been affected without fracturing the skull. A penetrating head injury is when something pierces the skull. A crushing head injury occurs when the head has been squeezed. Doctors assess head injuries as either minor, moderate or severe according to the Glasgow Coma Scale. In minor head injuries, the person remains alert, can answer questions and move their body. In moderate head injuries, the person appears confused, has difficulty speaking and can lose consciousness. In severe cases, the person shows little or no response, has little or no control over speech and loses consciousness for a prolonged period. Depending on the severity of the head injury, the individual may suffer a concussion, a fractured skull and a brain haemorrhage or bleeding inside the head. Possible long-term physical effects of a head injury may include muscle weakness, headaches, fatigue, dizziness and balance problems, loss of taste or smell, problems with vision or hearing, an imbalance in hormone levels and epilepsy. Long-term effects may also be psychological and include problems with thinking skills, concentration, memory, making plans or getting started on things, personality changes, anxiety and depression. Individuals who have experienced a moderate to severe head injury will need observation at the A&E of the hospital. This is followed by admission and treatment within hospital facilities and rehabilitation procedures will be tailored to individual needs. For more information on head injuries or other neurological problems, access the Brain and Spine Foundation's website or call our helpline. Our specialist nurses are here to help you and answer any queries you may have.